Alright, based on that game, I think I should still draw, because that was a top deck battle. Seems like a good keeper. Keeps his hand. Fume Spitter. Sure. Like to draw another forest now. Plague Singer. Throne of Geth. Doesn't seem like the best thing in the world. Guess I'll lead off with the Galvanizer. Blight Widow. Hmm. I think I'm actually going to play the Digester and the Dark Seal Axe. This way, if he wants to swing with Blight, Blight Widow, he has to kill the Digester with Fume Spitter. Trigon of Thought. Hmm. Yeah, I'll just... Play a Blight Widow of my own, I think. Draw a card. Drawing a card. I guess I should have gone first. I think I'd be winning if I had gone first. Because I would have the tempo advantage. Come on, swing. I am going to hook this guy up and swing with him because I can't get through with the artisan as long as he's got Blight Widow. I can double block the Blight Widow on the swing back with Mantis and Galvanizer. Although this lets him morbid plunder his back. Morbid plunder. Blight Widow. Hmm. Well, I'm just going to swing with my guy and play Bellowing Tangleworm, I think. Just stay on the offensive. Drawing a card. Digester. Fume Spitter. Horizon Spell Bomb. It's fine. It's a garbage.
Okay, here's where I think I just turn to slag Blight Widow and then swing with the team. Actually, not the team. Everything but Blight Widow. seems good for me. It's not the block I would make for sure. Why not just block the... T oh, he has trample, right? Yeah, that's the right block. And then give the trampler minus one, minus one, so you can start proliferating. Might have this... play Gollum Artisan with haste next turn if I draw a land. But I would only do that if he were he like tapped out or he's proliferating. Can't draw. That's pretty good. Ooh, he's out of charge counters on the Trigon of Thought. That's amazing. Uh-oh. Another Trigon of Thought. All right. I think I'm going to play Pierce Strider and equip the Galvanizer with Darksteel Axe. It looks like I have this, barring any crazy shenanigans. One, two, three, four, five, six. One off the Battle Sphere. Drawing card in response. Get in there, get him dangerously low in life, which is where I need him. I need to just draw land here and it should be good. No whammies. Contagious Nim, Ledmir. That is so hot. All right, well, one, two, three, four, five. I could just play the Artisan and give the Pierce Strider haste. I feel like I'm better off just dropping the Battle Sphere, playing the Artisan next turn, maybe with haste. He asked me, Triumphant Seventh Land for Battle Sphere? I'm not going to answer until after combat, but I will ob oblige him with the answer to that question. He's considering his blocks. Yeah, Gollum Artisan is way better than the Chimeric Mask. Maybe I shouldn't have swung with Mirror Galvanizer there. Seems worthwhile to get rid of his guys, though. Hmm. 
Ooh, he's mirror and meddling. Sure. And yes, I have it. He says you make me sick. Makes me sick with glee. He asked me why I would throw the galvanizer. He doesn't like that play. It's probably wrong. Necropeed, Plague Mob Beast. He's just dead though, because I can give him flying. One, two, three, four, five. Your battle sphere gets flying. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, not quite the win. Oh yeah, it is. It's totally the win. He's toast. I like his deck though. I think I deserve it though. And boom. Well, he's pretty close to actually stopping me from killing him here. Six. And match. Whew. On to the finals.